What's good, everybody? Welcome back to the channel. This is my Orcist uh, first place at the Winamat for the uh, Toon BLS uh, Comic Con Winamat. Uh, it's a really nice map. I'm not going to take it out. I'd rather have it sealed. Uh, but yeah, I want to give a shout out to Wadrio Legacy for sponsoring this video. Sally, their um, website is under construction at the moment, but make sure to check them out. After all that is done, uh, I want to give a shout out to my giveaway. If I somehow get to 1,000 subscribers by the end of the year, so the end of December, I'll be giving this away to one of my lucky subscribers. So make sure to subscribe, to like, share with all your friends. Let's get to that goal. And uh, yeah, I, I think we're going to get started. Uh... So Orchists, we have three Gearsu, three Nightmare, two Skeleton, one Bombard, and two Wands. I think this is pretty standard. Uh, nothing is really interchangeable. The ratios are fine as is. So, yeah. That's for the Orchestra. Next, we have the Scrap Engine. Uh... This is with it, just because this is what you want to send off of uh, Recycler. This is basically what a Lion used to be, but overall this card is just way better than a Lion, so I don't even know why this wasn't played over it. Uh, overall, super solid engine. Uh, breaks boards. It kind of just does everything, so there's really no reason not to play it. Uh, Armageddon Knight. I don't play Greffer. I just prefer one card instead of having to rely on 1.5. I'd rather have this plus like extra like like dangers extenders in that way over a grapher. Although he is very good, I couldn't find the space. Dangers I have uh, uh yeah <laughs> that's all of them. Uh this is mostly for Dragoon. But overall he's a good pop and these are standard. Next, the PKs, one of each. This searches this, this searches the second fog blade. So that's enough. You don't really need it anymore. Um, one Gizmac, obviously, and the Buster Lock. Uh, this deck obviously makes a lot of dark monsters, so getting to the Union Carrier early, very easy. Should be no problem. Um... Three returns. Uh, you want the draw power. And uh, this is just obviously the best one. It's the most generic one for the deck. Uh, Lore is pretty good too, but I just can't find the space for it. Uh, with the one babble, that's obvious. In this format, I think you kind of have to play this in every deck. Triple Droplet. This card is absolutely busted. Uh, outs Dragoon, outs just huge boards. Sadly, Herald is still a thing, but overall, this card is still really good. Next, uh, Double Twin. Uh, since this deck isn't the most popular, I prefer having Twin over something like Cosmic. Because uh, getting rid of two and you get to pitch one out of your hand is just really good. So, yeah. Two Twins. Don't question the rarities, by the way. Uh, it's a very back and forth with like ulties and then like common like nightmares but you know uh one succession is for lib obviously and i'm playing orcus so this is mandatory next traps obviously we got the one crescendo uh double fog blade obviously for the pks and triple imperium that's the only hand trap i play in the main deck i think it's just the most solid one so yeah let's get to the extra deck uh, double Galatea, uh, standard, you don't want to play three anymore. One long, and double ding, uh, standard for the Orca stuff. One Link Revo, this is for Gear Soup, this is the, for the Rosenix token, if you want to do that. Wyvern, busted, Lib, busted. Like, having these two, so this is a pop and this is a shuffle, having both of them with just one recycler it's kind of gross so yeah 
Buster Lock, obviously. Masquerade next, I'm playing Orcus. Bardiche, this card is busted. Uh, it gives you an extra pop when you summon him on your opponent's turn. And just getting double Fog Blade for free, it's crazy. Uh, Unicorn, uh, Mascarena, Appalooza. You can make this early with the Scrap Engine, so overall it's really good. Uh, Zeroboros, this just steals wins if you're able to Gizmek at least a couple times, which is something I did yesterday. I gizmec three times. Barely made him, but I made him with Mascarena Protection. And just attack for game. Just, that's a big boy. And then the one access code. Uh, he's just good for breaking boards if you need to. Especially if you've gone through the scrap engine. You have this, this. Uh, probably this as well in Grave. So yeah, you just have a lot, of, a lot of attributes. Now, the side deck. This was my biggest disappointment. Um, the side deck really was just underwhelming. Um... I'd suggest making your own. Make sure to use this deck as a template. Obviously, this is the alpha build. We're not even at beta yet. My This build is not perfect by any means. Do what you like to do. Make sure to get better at deck building every day. This was terrible. This was absolutely terrible. Um, it's just not worth it. Uh, adding this brick... To make something that makes your board slightly better. Like, I understand that it plays around a Dark Ruler. Like, you go ding and then into this. So they can't really do anything. But you already play around Dark Ruler. <laughs> like, you have double Fog Blade. You have a live ding. Like, you, you should survive. At the very least. And you should have enough resources next time to kill. So this was just underwhelming. I'm honestly glad I didn't main it. Or else this would just bricked me a lot. Um, Double Nibiru, definitely kept putting this up to three. I didn't see it all day, but it would have helped in so many scenarios where I lost. Uh, Duster, uh, this is meant to be Triple Storm, but I actually don't have them, so this is actually what I played at the tournament. Um, Hatred Aid is basically just a budget uh, Storm. Uh, overall, it's a really good card in my opinion, and uh, yeah, I would genuinely recommend it. Reboot, yeah, OTK easy. The worst card in my side deck. Uh, this card was absolutely horrendous. Uh, probably gonna play something like Radian, maybe the Gamma Package. I just need more for going second. I had too much for going first. Um, and yeah, this card, absolutely disgusting. Uh, would recommend you send a, you summon Ding off your. Skeleton on their turn, double pop, use this, or even just end on a ding if you want, and then you can summon him after, but like, god dang, this card is disgusting, like, it's a bit worse against Eldritch, because, you know, they just go, in phase, and then it's like their whole board is full again, but, uh, it is what it is, overall, I honestly enjoyed this deck, it was really fun to play, uh, haven't played it obviously since we had harp missed that boy but yeah i hope you guys enjoyed uh make sure your deck building yourself use it as a template uh and yeah like subscribe share and peace